that's out. And he does the game. Oh, he's so good. My opening batsmen are from vastly uh, different eras. Go back a long way to Jack Hobbs, at, uh, number one, the uh, Surrey stalwart. And his opening partner, Barry Richards, certainly one of the best opening batsmen I ever bowled at. The incomparable uh, Donald Bradman has to be at number three, and he's my captain as well. And I've got uh, Vivian Richards at uh, number four. And he does the game. It's another thing. Sometimes underrated all-rounder, Jacques Callis makes his way into the side. Catch that he does! What a catch, Jacques Callis! At number six, I've got Kumar Sangakkara, who's my wicketkeeper. Perhaps the greatest all-rounder of all time comes in at number seven. That's uh, Garfield Sobers, uh, averaging very nearly 60 with the bat and just over 30 with the ball. Capable of bowling fast, swing, spin. So he's the complete cricketer. Imran Khan, the Pakistan all-rounder, at to number eight, brought the art of reverse swing into world cricket. And then at number nine, the incomparable Shane Warne, the world's uh, best ever leg spin bowler. Very difficult choice for the uh, two quickies down at 10 and 11, but I've gone for Malcolm Marshall from the West Indies, the complete uh, pace bowler on any surfaces all around the world. Oh, he's so good! Glenn McGrath, perhaps from the modern era, the best bowler in terms of any conditions of uh, swing, seam and accuracy, the main thing. That's my all-time 11. What's yours?